at it again, and we have another one from Liberty Hangout and Caitlin. And um, just from the title of this one alone, I know it's going to be good. Let's dive in. If someone came up to me and said, I hate white people, I hate you because you're white, did I just experience racism from that? No. But if I said those exact same words and twisted the skin color, it would be racist. Absolutely. 100%. Yeah. I did not go through that course of who can be racist towards each other. Interesting. Right. But Probably I'm because good. you're white. So. Oh, because I'm white, I didn't go through the racism course. Probably not. Yes or no? Can white people experience racism? No. 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 No? No. By definition, no. What's the definition? Um, I would have to Google it really quickly, but... Do that for me. Okay. Okay, let me, let me Google it for you. Yeah, I'm interested. Oh, not me on 5%. Hold on. Do you think it's possible for white people to experience racism? No. It's not? No. How not? Because they haven't been they haven't been in the situation of being suppressed. So they don't it's hard to be it's hard to be racist when you don't have any sort of history of that happening. Like it's that experience, I don't know, it doesn't it, it's not possible to me. These Karen's are like had like a couple minutes of, you know, on social media being harassed. I'm like, now you're getting a taste of what people of color have been experiencing for years. I mean, this is something I've heard online before where, you know, People say the Holocaust was a big thing, you know, white people were, you know, um, mistreated, you know, murdered. And, and that's true, the Holocaust was real, but it was the mo it's, it was publicized. You don't really see the history of what people of color have been experiencing in the United States, so. Do you want a debate me instead of maybe explaining why I'm wrong? You want a debate me instead of yeah. cussing at me? Would you like to have a conversation? No, I don't have a conversation with bigots. But they, how am I a bigot? You don't know? <laughs> He's like, I don't know. All right, well, guess we follow the girls around here. Green hair. Okay. Oh, my God, my oh, man. And these, you know, it, it's so terrible and disgusting. These people see themselves as so righteous and so, so heavenly, so good. And yet they're the worst people around us. Call their terrible names. Oh, I don't speak with bigots. And storming off. And let, let, let's see what she has to say, though. But, I mean, you, you see the same kind of pattern repeating over and over with a lot of these folks that, you know, supposedly hate bigots and hate the R, people who are the R word and all of this stuff. And yet they're some of the most hateful folks around. But anyway. I don't know. All right, well, definitely follow the girls around here. Green hair. Okay. Oh, my God, my green hair. Oh, my God. Why don't you come talk to me instead of, instead of cussing? Why don't you have a conversation? She's cursing at her now. <laughs> They're incapable. They're incapable of having conversation. I can't find the exact definition right now, but to be racist, you have to have power over. Hold on, hold on. Why couldn't you find the exact definition? Like you kind of have to be an oppressor. Like a majority. We, uh, a, a majority. Group of people who like, has power over a group of people. Okay. Right. right now, white people are the majority. White people have, for a long period of time, been oppressors. So it's. A diff quite difficult to oppress the oppressor. Right. Okay, well, I'm not talking about giving them oppression. If someone came up to me and said, I hate white people, I hate you because you're white, did I just experience racism from that? No. A prejudice, but not racism. Okay. There's a difference between racism and prejudice. Right. What is the definition of both so I can understand? Let me, I, I think it's... Because I'm pretty sure racism, if I'm not mis... Hold on, what did the chick say? ...of both so I can understand. Let me, I... I think like it because no I'm pretty sure racism if I'm not mistaken I didn't I didn't catch what the chick in the mask said this chick right here I was trying to listen in to see what what she said but Caitlin I think her name's Caitlin was talking at the same time and it is just thinking you're superior your race is superior to another and anybody can feel that way right black people Hispanic people mm -hmm. brown people Asian people white people but I think that there's a certain validation that comes with the racism sorry, sorry. that uh, that comes with the racism that comes from white people to black people I can spew things that are like hateful to you like all day but at the end of the day like psychologically the trauma like it's not going to affect you the way it's going to affect me it just how do you know what trauma people want to be victims so bad they want to be their ancestors so bad what trauma please tell me oh people today act like they were enslaved and had to go through all of that was it horrible yes absolutely we can all agree on that that's obvious duh we know but people today act like they experienced the same thing that those other folks went through back in the day like that I just don't understand why do you want to be a victim?
Basically, the trauma, like it's not going to affect you the way it's going to affect me. It just, How do you know? How can you judge me like that just because of my skin color? Not devil's advocate right now. I'm, I'm, um, uh, If okay. someone came up to me and said, I hate you because you're white, right. did I just experience racism? Uh, I guess. I guess, yeah. Okay. I guess, yeah. So you can be racist towards white people. That's possible. Yeah. And if you say it like that, yeah. Well, that's racism, right? Mm, it's a complicated question. Racism is you dislike person because of the, the color of your skin, yeah. but there's also some significance behind it. I don't think it's just color to me, for me. That's my okay. experience. How are black people or people of color oppressed today in 2020 in America? Simply walking down the street. I mean, I'm from New York. Um, I'm a Hispanic woman. I'm in Florida now, a red state, because my because of my skin color. I know I'm look. Uh, people look at me weird down the street when I speak Spanish. People look at me funny when they see my name on a job application. I mean, oh yeah, you can tell there's a Hispanic woman. Um, which is why I think people of color really have to work twice as hard to kind of do, or even just to catch up. I've had just, tons of people in my inbox saying I'm. Can she prove that when people see her name on a job application, they change their opinion of her or something? Can she prove that? I don't think she can. I think that's just an assumption. Just saying. It's hard to kind of do, or even just to catch up. I've had just... tons of people in my inbox saying, I'm gonna kill you white bitch and your white family. You're a white bitch. We need less of you in my inbox. I can pull them up right now. Did, is that not racist? Um, it's wrong. It's, it's wrong, right. but it's not racist, in my opinion. Okay, I, but if I said those exact same words and twisted the skin color, it would be racist. Absolutely, hundred percent. Okay. Hundred percent. Well, gee, learning something new every, every day? day. The more you know. We've been out of school for a while. School's not in session. College isn't in session. I guess this is what is being taught. Are you guys in college? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Amazing. Well, if I may disagree with you, actually, there are quotas for minority. Uh, employment numbers. So actually, a lot of companies have quotas that if you see a, a Hispanic name, you hire them, no matter what their merits are, especially in universities. They push universities to go, it's, it's the law, to push them, even though their test scores are, oh, they're done. They're done with it. Anyway, we disagree, but I appreciate it. You want to say something real quick? Right. I think that's all written, and you know, that's the expectation, but it's not put into practice. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. I appreciate your point no of view. Yeah. I did not go through that course of who can be racist towards each other. Interesting, right. but Probably I'm because good. you're white, so. Oh, because I'm white, I didn't go through the racism course. Probably not. Oh. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh. The <laughs> Okay, very cool. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Very cool. You guys have a wonderful day. You, too. you know where to catch this video at. Sure. Interesting, thanks. I'm pretty sure I just got judged for the color of my skin, I, know, I don't know though. I could, I could have just been. Hold on, what'd she say? Just got judged for the color of my skin. I know, I don't know though. I could, I could have just been. She said something at college party or something. Did she say? Did she say? Hold on, did she? Hold on, wait a second. Did she actually say what I think she said? Wait a minute. Now, it, it, it just clicked to me. It, it took my brain a, a few extra seconds to process it, but hold Same. on. Thanks. I'm pretty sure I just got judged for the color of my skin. I, know, I don't know, though. I could, I could have just been... She did say that. She said, is it true that you pooped yourself at a college party? Well, she didn't say poop. She said the S word, but it got bleeped out, obviously. And then the security, like, all all walked up. She was like, oh, oh never mind. <laughs> well, hold on. Wait a minute. <laughs> that was amazing. That was amazing. Because what are they going to do? You know? Like, what my she bad, my bad, my bad. No way. No, she, did she say that? She's like, my bad. Because <laughs> they went, they were like... Sorry, I'll cut you off. That's okay. No, it's that. okay. It's yeah. okay. Can okay. I take a picture with you? Yes. So, of course, some more craziness here, obviously. Uh, I just I just don't understand why people want to be victims so bad. You know? It, it's, it's just weird.
it's weird and sad. Like, you want to be oppressed. You want to feel sad and mad at the world. Like, it's just, it's just weird. You're not oppressed. You didn't go through what, you know, some of our ancestors went through. It didn't happen to you. Stop it with the nonsense. Stop it. They would be ashamed watching some of these folks walk around today with, you know, act, acting like victims all the time. They would be ashamed, I'm sure. Now, now I don't know that for a fact. That's just my assumption, of course. But, um, yeah, that, that stuff is just absolutely, positively crazy to me. Absolutely crazy. And then, you know, when, when the guy um, Googled, tried to Google the definition of racism, <laughs> he acted like, oh, I can't, I can't find it now. No. You know what happened? I'll tell you exactly what happened. He Googled it. He read what the definition was and he didn't like it. It didn't fit with the narrative. So he didn't want to say it. So I, I can't, I, I, I can't tell. He, he said that his phone was on. I mean, granted, it was at 5%, but he, he could have still, you know, hit up Google real quick. That doesn't take very long. That's not going to drain your battery to hit up Google. You know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um, I love these videos because they just expose a lot of the nonsense. And I think the nonsense ha nonsense has to be exposed and laughed at because it's just ridiculous. It's It's gone on for far too long people getting away with saying bs once again like people acting like victims how are you a victim it just doesn't make any sense and then to to wrap this all up with the whole r word thing that is just foolishness white people can't experience uh racism how simply because of their skin color oh so now we're judging people based on skin color again gotcha mighty ironic that you're saying that when uh, whatever <laughs> anyway y'all let me know what you thought about all of this foolishness in the comment section below like share comment and of course hit that subscribe button before you go peace and love i'm out